Hello, hello! And we are back with some more Mafia 3. Right, so we're on our way to talk to Jock Blanchard. Jock's ready to update you on how Toretto is currently shitting himself. So, yes, we're off there. Hopefully we can pin down Greto and take him out. Oh, I wonder if we can cut through. About this door. Yeah, there we go. Hello. Yeah, that's cool. Andy Toretto's down at the dock union, demanding to know who's been stopping his people from collecting dues. Think he tipped off Greco to what's been happening? Nah. Knowing Andy, he'd probably see Greco in the ground next to you if he could. But he's a lifer, and if he's got a job to do, he's gonna goddamn well do it. Bad fucking situation all around. And is about Evidently. to get worse. Tell the boys they'll be back to work soon, Jock. Right, let's confront him. Yeah, we've got a couple of health. Uh, what gun have we got? Yeah, we're alright. We've got a Tommy gun and a pistol. Uh, there is a bit more health just there, though. Grab this. Right. Full elf. Sorry, Doc. We best behave. Hello, I'm Johnny Cash. Oh my God, lights! Come on. There's a lot of room. Right. Three centuries by the looks of it. Building, so hmm. Yeah, I came to come out of here. Come on, out right, you pop. Go. Right, who's 
Who's up there? Huh? I don't know which way he comes. He's coming this way, isn't he? Yep, here he comes. Oh, good, it's a sentry as well. Still two sentries over there. Right, that's a bus guy, so. Check out that area over there. Well, wow, they're miles away then. Hmm. Sneaky, sneaky. Check out that area over there. You're supposed to have my back. Mr. I for help. You ain't going now, boy. Need to lay low. Go somewhere. Where did he go? Going down. Right then. Greco's on his last. You standing with him or me? Fuck you. All right, I'm with you. I'm the Toretto. Good God. Hey, we got another racket. Right, so. Yes, we'll give that to Vito. Uh, ooh! What about Doc? I don't know the help out that is what we want. The 
dock union's under control. Put some of you guys on it. I'll send them over. And Lincoln, just cause Greg goes a dipshit doesn't mean he's a pushover. They'll probably send out some of his men, have him try and take you out. So watch your ass. Get your hands on Greco and rough him up all you want, but don't kill him. That's for me. Okay. Got it. Right. Vito's taking over, look. Here they come. Oh, nice, Vito's cars. I was in the third platoon company C of the 614th Tank Destroyer Battalion during World War II. I trained as a medic. I still carried a gun. Every man in our company was black. Army didn't know what to do with us other than they didn't want us fighting with the white men. Klimbach. Klimbach was that little French town up there near the border with Germany, and we were ordered to take it. Now, the crowds took out three of the four anti-tank guns we had. There was no way in hell we were letting them get the better of us. We were determined to show we was just as good, if not better, than every other soldier in the service. I, I don't like talking about the medals I got over there. The only way a man survives something like that is through the grace of God. Doesn't seem right. Celebrate a little piece of tin. No one knows I helped Lincoln except for you and John Donovan. Not that I'm keeping it a secret, mind you. Just that nobody ever came around and asked about it. Right. A little bit more backstory there for us. I'll have some elf while I'm here. Ooh. Yeah, let's use my shotty for a bit. Sweet. I've got another help bar. Awesome. Right. So, what is next? Uh, circle up with Vito to just go for it. Okay, let's do it. Where are all those lovely cars we drove in? Yeah. That's, that's what I want. Let's go talk to Vito. I'm really enjoying this. I think I'm about 14 hours in or so now. It's looking pretty good. And we're only, what are we? Tells us somewhere. Uh, that might be collection now. Yeah, yeah. That's not. What it told you, like, game percentage. Shit, I need to turn left. Come on, lights. Right. 
Where is he? I don't know where he is. What's this Vito's pad? Oh. Records in that building at the end of the block. A lot of whores in there. He's probably face down a pussy right now. You got any muscle with him? A couple of meatheads. I'll go around the front, you take the back. He tries to run, grab his ass. Nobody kills that prick but me. Got it. Those are Marcano's guys. Ah, shit. God, suck. Come on, back to the car, you drive. I'll cover us. Fuck if that little prick gets away. Go! The fucker almost went through the windshield. It, is that? How the fuck did Greco end up with that car? Fuck, Link. He's a little fuck. That's how. Drive. God damn it! Why don't you just let Marcano handle this jackass? Marcano would just kill a little shit stain. I want to take my time. Oh Besides, well. Well. Until I can get at Marcano directly. This is the next best goddamn thing. Point taken. Oh, cool. Greco, you cocksuckers are next. You fuckers missed me. Don't shoot my car, Vito. Oh, what? I ain't making any promises. No way I'm letting that dipshit get away. All right. Slippin son of a bitch, stay on him. I'm trying. Yeah, I didn't think it was my car. Go on then, finish him. Are you gonna kill him or what? Get away! Fuck! Fuck, god damn it! The fuck are you? Let's get him the fuck out of here. The cops are closing in. Let me get the door. Yeah. Come on. Cool. Cool. Let's go. Not one thick. The fucking cops are on our ass. What? What happened? You crossed the wrong motherfucker. That's what happened. Now shut the fuck up. Drive. Settle down back there, kiddo. Ride will be over soon. You took a shit, motherfucker. Don't Yet. 
Oh, no way. Yeah. We lost him. Pull her onto the chum shack in the back. And as for you, have a little dignity. Christ. Help! Don't go fucking help! help! <laughs> awesome. Watch out for cops. Don't want to get pulled over with this asshole in the back seat. Oh, that end. Whew. Shit. <laughs> for a couple of years there. I really thought I might be done with all the Jimmy Cagney bullshit. But here I am. Funny. I kind of figured you for more than would you? I don't really want to go that way. Yeah, that's kind of type. <laughs> Look at you, kid. You know, God's got a sense of humor, too. It's sick oh, as God. shit, but that motherfucker's got one. Oh, God, that cop nearly saw me. <laughs> right, take him back home. So Vito can do whatever he wants. Quite nice, this car. Right now, get a big Hank double well, it was. Fries and one of our famous malted milkshakes for only 75 cents. Hank's Burger Bar. Check the yellow pages for the location nearest you. I don't really want to take, follow this cop all the way home, but don't look like I've got much choice. Why is there a cop here? Come on, lights. God damn it. gone. Right. There we go, Vito. I get it. But this? You never tried anything like this before. I don't. I don't. Come on, Mikey. Why do you want me gone all of a sudden? He said you were a carpet, baby. Never should have been down here in the first place. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, uh... Keep going, you got nine more. Fuck, listen, Jesus, he was worried you knew about the casino. And so we're gonna play up to Leo in the commission. What casino? <laughs> Answer the question. Uncle Sally's. You, you, you see that construction across the lake? He's building a casino over there. He wants to go legit. Turn this city into Las Vegas. Gambling's illegal. Uh, yeah, no shit, it's illegal. Uh, which is why he's paid a bunch of money to get the lost chain. Who else is involved in this? I don't know. I don't know, I swear it! <laughs> Look, I, 
I told you what you wanted to know. You're gonna let me go now, right? Oh. I don't think so. Yeah, sure. Oh. Stupid fucking prick. I'll clean this mess up. No reason for you to stick around. Remember our deal. I'm expecting to cut of everything you bring in. Yeah, I know how this shit works. You'll get your money. It's a woman named Alma. Helps me out some folks. Cuban. Mean as fuck. She talked to us, see if she needs anything. Might be an easy way to bring in some extra money. Where's she at? At the warehouse. All right. What are you gonna do with him? Fish gotta eat like everyone else. <laughs> awesome. At what point did you become aware that Sal Marcano wanted to build a casino north of the city? Pretty early on. Michael Greco told Lincoln about it. And Lincoln Clay's plan was to specifically target various entities related to Marcano's casino plan? Between the bribes he was paying out to get gambling legalized and the money needed to pay off the commission, Sal was stretched pretty thin. So, Lincoln used that to his advantage. Forced Sal into making some extremely hard decisions. Decisions that would limit his options. Ah. Uh -huh. Interesting. I'm telling you, we make twice as much bread moving heroin as we would from a stupid fucking casino. Maybe three times. This ain't about the money. <laughs> You're joking, right? All I ever heard from you is, don't give me that goddamn excuses, you understand? You pay me what's fucking owed. You think this is a game, mm -hmm. son. And it's my fault for playing along with you. We're not setting you straight. But it's not a game. This shit wears on you. Grinds you down. I ain't had a decent night's sleep in 43 years. And then after Lucho, shh. But hey, we got the cocksuckers who did that. Every last one of them. Yeah, and your uncle's still dead, ain't he? You think sitting in that chair makes you special, huh? Somehow puts you above all the bullshit. Well, it's the opposite. All it does is paint a giant goddamn bullseye on your forehead. There's a price to be paid for all this, you understand? And I'm tired of paying it. Mainly, I'm worried I'm gonna get a phone call telling me you're dead in a gutter somewhere. What do you expect me to do, huh? Work the front door? Glad hand folks as they come on in, maybe give them a quick slap on the ass. You run it with me. And here, after a few years, after I know everything's settled down, you'll take over. Find yourself a nice woman. Give me some fucking grandkids. Sounds boring as fuck. Not on my watch. It's the only way, son. The world is changing. Used to be people knew their place. Now everybody's screaming about equality. Now they all deserve a slice of the pie. Niggas, mix, gooks, you name it. Our way of doing things won't work in a world like that. Oh, who's on the phone? Yeah. You come to me with something like this, Lou, you better be goddamn sure. Yeah. Lincoln Clay is still alive. What? Fuck. Ha ha ha. Right. Ooh. Yeah, let's assign it to Vito. Right, so we've got some optional missions for Alma that uh, um, burned thingy uh, that, yeah, Vito's chum. Uh, we've got a CIA mission and we could go. Oh, I wouldn't mind getting Burke. So he's up here. So we could go to Burke in the next episode. I think we'll do that because I want to have like all three guys. Uh, I'll probably get all these junction boxes done while like in between episodes. Oh, right, Father James wants something. 
Okay. Is that an optional mission? Yeah, it is. Okay. Cool. Uh, but yeah. Oh, and John Donovan wants to talk to me. Okay, so quite a few people on a chat. Uh, but yeah, we'll leave that episode there, guys. And we'll pick this up in the next one. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you later. Bye.